Third baseline will be Darren Wolverton. Now if you'll please stand, remove your cap for the playing of our national anthem. Welcome in, everybody, to the Neville Tiger Network as we bring you this afternoon's game as the Neville Lady Tigers host the Boshian Lady Gators. Hello, everybody. Stuart Shelby in here from the Family Solutions broadcast booth. The Paul McElroy Complex here in Forsyth Park as it's quarterfinal time. These two tangling to see who will head to Sulphur next weekend for this state <coughs> tournament. Had a few little technical issues as we tried to bring you the pregame, but we haven't missed a pitch as we are ready to go here as Bo Shin brings number five, Chloe Bombele, the shortstop, to the plate. Eddie Nicholson in the circle for the Tigers. Eddie Bagwell behind the plate. This ball ripped down the line in right field. Boogie Specks going after it. Bonvalle all the way to third. The throw's going to come in. It's high. And a leadoff triple gets things going for both shins. Bo Shin, a winner over Assumption, seven to four in seven innings last week. Now Gabby Angel, the second baseman. Squares bunt to bunt. She gets it down, the throw to the plate, not going to be in time. So a sacrifice for Angel. She's going to plate the first run for the Gators.
That pitch now to Lindsey Manuel. A little high for ball one. One oh, change up in there for a called strike. Nice pitch. Well, there's one gone here in the top of the first as we're just underway. And the pitch misses high. Ball laced into left center. Leela Hansen has a bead on it. She's going to get it in quickly, but Manuel has a single. And now Christian Lalonde is coming up to bat. She's the third baseman. Bo Shin coming out fired up here to start this ball game. Brought a nice crowd from Arneville. See if the Tigers keep this threat to a minimum here. That's a nice pitch. The off speed is in there for a strike. A one. Just off the mark. Called strike two. One ball and two strikes to the Gator third baseman. Pitch outside. Two, two. Line right back up the middle. Lofton has it. Steps on second for one and over to first for two. And the Tigers in the threat. Nice job as that ball careened off of Nicholson, but Ellie Lofton was there to pick it up. The Tigers are out of this one. They do give up one run on two hits. There were no errors and nobody left on base. We move to the bottom half of the first. one nothing. Bo Shin. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Clean King is a full-service cleaning and restoration company specializing in carpeted upholstery, air ducts and dryer vents, tile and grout, and mold and water extraction. We offer 24-7 emergency water and fire damage service because your emergency is important. We take pride in being locally owned, serving Senla for over 30 years. Trust Clean King to exceed expectations for a healthy home and business. Call us today for a free quote. Let Tenori's Own Wolf help you with your special gift needs. Offering a wide variety of products to make any tiger happy. Go visit Tenori's located at 801 Louisville Avenue or give them a call at 318-325-4100. That's Tenori's Own Louisville. We're back for the bottom half of the first inning. The Boshin Gators played it a run in the first. Now it's the Tigers' turn as they come to bat here for the first time this afternoon. Il Carter, her third game back, leads things off. She's playing third this afternoon for Neville. Pitcher is Lexi Gotro for the Gators. Carter attempts a bunt. 
Couldn't get it down. Defensively for Bo Shin, you've got Gotro in the circle. Addy Arno is the catcher. In left field is Lindsey Manuel. Finish it after this pitch. That pitch outside. The center fielder is Emmy Marks. In right field, you have Camille Champagne. Then you've got third baseman Chris Kirsten Lalon. Uh, the shortstop is Chloe Bonvalet. Uh, the second baseman, Gabby Angel. And the first base is Jyla Rido. Ball slapped towards short. Ball gets away from. Here we go. Back to the bag. There's a lot of stuff was going on. Shortstop Bondelay backhand that ball and got rid of it. The throw was high, and it bounced off the brick wall here at Carl Smith. L. Carter takes off to second, and then the throw was there, but ball gets kicked out of the glove of Angel at second. So now L. Carter ends up at second. I'm going to give her an infield hit on that. She's going to get to second on the error. Now Leela Hansen. So the rest of these Tiger lineup is. Well, there's eight seniors here. L. Carter being the junior on second base. That pitch is called strike. Tigers trying to answer the run, but Bo Shin scored in the first. Hansen fouls this one back into the net. Actually out. Just over the Family Solutions broadcast booth. Now, no balls and two strikes to the Tiger center fielder. This ball grounded towards short. Bonvalle is up with it. Throw it. Gets away again. And now Hanson wisely comes back to first as the brick wall has been the Boshin's Gators friend. That kept Hanson from going to second. But she's going to get on on the air by the shortstop there. Now Tigers have runners on first and third and Ellie Lofton up to bat. Lofton coming out off a five for five showing earlier this week in Bell Chase. Often shows bunt early, pulls it back. Pitch misses inside. Nice day here at the ballpark. Right around 80 degrees. Slight south wind blowing. You can see it's blowing directly out of Carl Smith. Late pullback on the bunt. Hansen's going to take second. Now Tigers with runners at second and third. Nobody out here. Here's a 2-0 pitch. Line but foul down the first baseline. It's a 2 1. This one looped into right field. That's going to bring in a run. Hanson is going to be held up at third. So, an RBI single for Ellie Lofton. 
ties this ball game up. Now KK Worsham comes up. Worsham, three for four with a couple of runs scored last Wednesday against Bell Chase in the second round. Pulls this back, called strike as Lofton easily takes second. Now once again, the Tigers have runners at second and third with nobody out. A one. Lifted. It's going to be down. The shortstop's going to have to get rid of it. She does. But a nice job by KK of putting the ball in play. That's going to score Hanson. But an RBI ground out there for KK gives the Tigers their first lead of the ball game. Now Addie B. Grounds this one to second. The second baseman's up with it. That's Angel. Does move the runner to third. Now there's two gone here. Lofton is at third. And there's two gone. Now Sarah Zambi's turn. Senior first baseman for the Tigers. Strike right down the middle. So one pitch, it's high, ball, ball one. One pitch, fouled back into the screen. Gotro trying to get the Gators out of this inning. Is this ball tapped towards third, Zambi. Trying to run it out, but a nice play by Kirsten Lalonde is going to retire the side, but not before the Tigers strike back with two runs on two hits. There were two errors. They left one runner on base. We move to the second. Tigers lead the Gators 2-1. to one. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Hey, Neville Tiger Nation, this season, if you find yourself feeling a little under the weather, visit Go Family Health on North 18th Street. They cover flu shots, sports physicals, sick visits, annual visits, or if nothing is wrong, they can do your regular checkup. Go Family Health has a happy staff, clean office, and they can take care of all your family's health care needs. This is Tiffany Tara with Go Family Health. We love our Neville Tigers. And we want to thank all of Neville Nation for always supporting Go Family Health. Do you suffer from frequent back or neck pain? Were you in an accident and can't get rid of those constant aches? Maybe you're someone who deals with chronic migraines and tension headaches. It might be time to see how Martinez Chiropractic can help you. The goal of Martinez Chiropractic is to reduce or eliminate pain in just a few sessions using the latest in chiropractic technology. Don't suffer in pain another day. Call Martinez Chiropractic today at 318-654-4310 or see him in person 1828 Tower Drive in Monroe. Welcome back, everybody. We've made it to the second inning. Tigers leading Bo Shin two to one. 
Leading off for Bo Shin is Jyla Rideau. It's the first pitch from Addie Nicholson high for a ball. Defensively for the Tigers. Nicholson on the mat or in the circle. Addie Bagwell behind the plate. Third base, you have El Carter. Shortstop is Ellie Lofton. Madeline Jones at second. Sarah Zambi is at first. Pitch misses. Left fielders, KK Worsham. Leela Hansen's in center. Boogie Specks back in the lineup in right field for Neville. Two-o pitch, fouled off the end of the bat. Two-one pitch, swing and a miss. Nice little breaking pitch there from Nicholson. As the, you can see the magnolia leaves fluttering down in that south wind, blowing them onto the field. Change up, misses high. Now a full count to the gate at first baseman. Three, two. Tapped in front of the plate. That's a fair ball. Nice job by Addie Bagwell to come out and get Rito for the first out of the second. Now it's Emmy Marks' turn. Center fielder for Beauchamp. There's a strike called. Pitch lifted towards short. Ellie Lofton's there. Quickly, there's two gone. Now Jordan Wheeler, the designated player. Pitch misses a little low. Ball two. Two O pitch high. Now three and O. This is what. Nicholson wants to avoid his two out walks. There's a 3 0 pitch. It's low, ball four. Wheeler gets to first. Now the catcher, Addy Arno. Arno shows bunt, pulls it back, takes a ball. Arno all the way to the back of the batter's box, and she slaps this one into short right center. A walk, then a single. Puts a couple of base runners on for the Gators. Now to the nine hole hitter, Camille Champagne, the right fielder. We're going to run for the catcher, 
or no? At, that's still Arno at, fir at first. They thought about it. This ball popped up. Lofton shading her eyes from the sun. It makes the catch no problem, and the threat is over here in the second. No runs on one hit and no errors. Boshin leaves two runners on base. Move to the bottom of the second. Neville leading Boshin 2-1. to one. We'll be right back. Baton Rouge, Shreveport, New Orleans. Attorneys from all over our state are flocking to our area to handle your injury case. I'm Chad Carter. And I'm Kevin Alexander. We didn't come in from out of town to take your case. If you've been injured, come see us at Parker Alexander. We live and work right here in Northeast Louisiana. Remember, we don't get paid unless you get paid. So we're here to handle your case personally. I'm Dr. Scott Shelby with Family Solutions. When you hear the words Family Solutions, you may not know that we're a comprehensive, strength-based counseling and psychiatric clinic. Family Solutions provides psychiatric care, individual and couples therapy, child and adolescent counseling, psychological testing, medication management. We also provide occupational therapy, physical therapy, speech therapy, and ABA therapy in one convenient location. For more information on how we can help your family today, visit FamilySolutionsCounseling.org. Welcome back here to the Neville Tiger Network. We're in the bottom of the second here. Neville is hosting the Boucher Gators from Arnoville, Louisiana in the quarterfinals of the Class 4A LHSAA playoffs. Bree Roberts, the designated player, is going to lead things off for Neville. First pitch from Lexi Gotro is in there for a strike. Oh one. Low and in. Takes that one right down the pipe. One ball is in two strikes. This ball hit hard into left and no trouble for Lindsey Manuel. She turned around a little bit, but makes a nice catch over her shoulder, and there's one gone. Well, Boogie Specs comes up with one out. Boogie getting her first start since her injury earlier this season. That one for a strike. So one tie. One pitch, low, two and one. This 
Specs lifts this one. Is it going to get over the shortstop? No. Nice play by Bonvalet. And Specs is going to fly out. Now Madeline Jones, second baseman for the Tigers. Takes a strike. Jones with a couple of RBIs and a run score against Bill Chase. She grounds this one back to Gotro. Tosses it over, and that's going to do it for the Tigers here in the second. No runs, no hits, and no errors, no men left on base. Move to the third. Tigers still lead 2-1. to one. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Mama DeLuca's pizzas are custom made, fresh to order right in front of you. We offer three different sizes of pizza, 9, 12, or 14 inch. Mama DeLuca's pizza is prepared to your order. The pizza cooks in less than three minutes. We have 16 different toppings to choose from, eight unique sauces to complete your pizza. In addition to pizzas, we offer to our customers boneless wings with your choice of a dipping sauce. Mama DeLuca's pizza offers delicious garlic parmesan breadsticks, freshly made to order pasta bowls. We're Mama DeLuca's pizza in the subway on Lammy Lane, and we hope to see you soon. Eason Portable Buildings is now Eason Manufacturing. New name, same quality service with almost 60 years experience serving the Arklamas. And with Eason Manufacturing, quality is second to none. Buy pre-made from one of our mini lots or custom order yours today. Choose your colors, choose your size. You design it, we build it. Eason Manufacturing, serving the Arklamas since 1961. Welcome back as Bonvalle taps this one to second. Quick throw needed but made by Madeline Jones. And there's one gone. Gabby Angel on sacrifice bunt her first time up. Pitch from Nicholson, a little outside. Push in back to the top of their lineup. That pitch misses high, much to the dismay of a few Tiger fans. Angel with that. And a split grip. There's a strike. It's a 2 1 pitch from Addie Nicholson. Grounded towards second. Jones stabs it, throws over to Zambi. And they're going to be out at first. Nice. Stretch, they're gonna check it though here with the home plate umpire. Zambi makes the catch and keeps her foot on the bag. A nice play on both ends. So quickly, two gone. And then Lindsey Manuel. Singled in a run. Back in the first. Takes a first pitch for a ball and lines this one right at Jones. Madeline making all three plays here in the third. So 
No runs, no hits, no errors. Nobody left. We move to the bottom half of the third. Tigers still leading two to one. We'll be right back. Being a strong team means accomplishing great things by working together. Being a Neville Tiger means striving for excellence in all things. Origin Bank and Neville High School share a long history of making a difference in our community. Together with the Food Bank of Northeast Louisiana, we're able to provide meals to children, families, and seniors facing hunger in Northeast Louisiana. Origin Bank and Neville Tiger football, always a winning combination. Origin Bank, member FDIC. You told me one click. You told me one call. You told me you'll get it done. I called. But never got you. Instead, I was handed off to someone else. In fact, I never even met you. Are you even for real? Don't be misled. If you've been injured, you deserve to meet with the actual attorney you saw on TV. At Parker Alexander, you'll meet with me. Or me. We'll fight to get the money you deserve. Remember, there's never a fee unless we get money for you. And that's for real. Welcome back as the Tigers are going to lead off the third with the top of their lineup. L. Carter, who singled and scored back in the first, stands in. Third baseman playing short for the slap hitting Carter. Lifts this one. Going to be an easy out to second. That one was popped up. Hanson reached on an error and scored the, the other run for the Tigers. Laces this one into right center field with the right fielder. Champong gets over to it, makes the catch, and there's two gone. Bo Shin fans, you can hear. Brought their cowbells today. Now Ellie Lofton takes the ball low. See if she can't get something going for the Tigers here in the third. Called strike. Ball lifted behind first, the first baseman. That's Rito, she's there. And that's gonna do it for the Tigers. No runs, no hits, no errors. Nobody left. Move to the fourth. Your score still Neville two, Bo Shen one. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Clean King is a full-service cleaning and restoration company specializing in carpeted upholstery, air ducts and dryer vents, tile and grout, and mold and water extraction. We offer 24-7 emergency water and fire damage service because your emergency is important. We take pride in being locally owned, serving Senla for over 30 years. Trust Clean King to exceed expectations for a healthy home and business. Call us today for a free quote. Let Tenori's Own Wolf help you with your special gift needs. 
offering a wide variety of products to make any tiger happy. Go visit Tenori's located at 801 Louisville Avenue or give them a call at 318-325-4100. That's Tenori's on Louisville. Third baseman, Chris Kirsten Lalonde. Third baseman, Chris Kirsten Lalonde. Going to lead things off for Bo Shin here in the fourth. Called strike as they say she went. All three runs scored in this ballgame were scored in the first inning. And then it's been pretty efficient since then. Pitch just misses the outside corner. Ball grounded, fair, down the left field line. That's going to be extra bases. Lalon around first. She's going to be held up at second. Throw comes in to third. And Lalon with a leadoff double. Jyla Rideau. Grounded out her first time up. Takes this pitch kind of off the end of the bat, but right at Madeline Jones. And a quick out there for the Tigers. Now, one out here for Emmy Marks. And she tries to tie things up here for her team. Marks flew out to short her first time up. Swing and a miss and a nice change up there from Nicholson. Oh one, outside. So one one pitch. Two one. This ball right off the end of the bat towards Lofton. She's gonna have to get rid of it. She does. And they call her out at first. If they appeal this one. They might have a case. We're going to appeal it. She, if, he's, if he was watching, she's going to be safe. If he wasn't, it's going to be an out. So we wait for the, the call. Yep. Marks with the infield single now. Puts runners at first and third. That's the correct call as Zambi just when she went to stretch, she extended it a little bit and her, her foot came off the bag. So now first and third situation here. Annie Bagwell giving the infield some signals. Now Jordan Wheeler who walked in her only appearance. Pitch is low. Tigers would love a double play ball right here. Corners are in. That pitch is high. Ball 
3-0. And now the runner moves up to second. Base open. Nicholson throws that one in there. Tigers still playing deep in the middle. Called strike two. Nicholson trying to fight her way back in this count. Three balls, two strikes to Wheeler. There's a 3-2 pitch. Ball four. Now the bases are loaded. Coach Chad Johnson is going to call time and talk to his team here in the circle. The only walks in this ball game have been issued to Jordan Wheeler. Now Addie Arno, who singled, and her only at bat. Slated to step in the box when all this is over. It's like Coach Johnson's talked about it. I think we might have a runner. We're going to have a runner for Wheeler. That's number one. Sage Chatan is the runner for Wheeler. Tiger infield playing in on the corners, even with the bag in the middle. We'll see what Arno tries. She swings at that off-speed pitch, unable to connect. Strike two. Strikeout would be nice here. There's yet to have we've yet to have a strikeout on either side. Pitches up and away. So we're in the eight and nine holes, or this is the eight hole, nine hole on deck here for Beauchamp. Here's a one two pitch. Foul back. Two, two. Yeah, Addy's got a challenger. Right here. Can't coax a easy ground ball out of her. That's 3-2. No place to put her. Now he just got a groove one here. Make her put it in play. 3-2 pitch. High ball four. Gonna play to run. Now this ball game is tied. Brings home Lalonde. Now Champagne is the right fielder for Bo Shin. She flew out to short her last time up.
Ball lifted and caught by Zambi. Leaping catch over there at first. That saved a couple of runs. Because if that gets over Sarah, at least one was coming in. So two gone now. We're back to the top with Bonvalet, the shortstop. He tripled her first time up. Pitch misses outside. Base is still loaded with Gators. Swing and a miss. Strike one. Timeout taken by the batter. We're ready to go. Big spot here. Stayed away from Bonvalet right there. That's two balls and one strike. Called strike. The outside corner. Nicholson one strike away from getting out of this one. Here's that 2-2 pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. And the Tigers get out of the jam. They do allow one run on one hit. There were no errors, but they leave three on base. We're tied, we move to the bottom of the fourth. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Baton Rouge, Shreveport, New Orleans. Attorneys from all over our state are flocking to our area to handle your injury case. I'm Chad Carter. And I'm Kevin Alexander. We didn't come in from out of town to take your case. If you've been injured, come see us at Parker Alexander. We live and work right here in Northeast Louisiana. Remember, we don't get paid unless you get paid. So we're here to handle your case personally. I'm Dr. Scott Shelby with Family Solutions. When you hear the words Family Solutions, you may not know that we're a comprehensive, strength-based counseling and psychiatric clinic. Family Solutions provides psychiatric care, individual and couples therapy, child and adolescent counseling, psychological testing, medication management. We also provide occupational therapy, physical therapy, speech therapy, and ABA therapy in one convenient location. For more information on how we can help your family today, visit FamilySolutionsCounseling.org. No, we got ourselves a tie ball game here in Monroe, Louisiana. And in the bottom of the fourth, and the Tigers send KK Worsham to the plate. An RBI ground out back in the first. Takes that pitch low for a ball one. Here's a 1-0, grounded, foul down just outside of the third back base bag. Yeah. 
It's a 1-1. It hits her. Worsham's going to get a free base. The Tigers have the leadoff runner on. Now Addie Bagwell. Grounded out to second her first time up. Here comes the runner. That's Stella Braddock. Going to run for KK. This runner for KK, number seven, Stella Braddock. Wind picking back up here, blowing directly out to center field. Bagwell definitely has the power. Ball grounded towards short. Bonvalet gets it to second. They're not going to get the speedy Bagwell at first. But Braddock is forced out. She's Bagwell will reach on the fielder's choice. And C probably going to have Shanice Specs come here and run. And you will. This number 12, play at first base, Sarah Zambi. Right. Sarah Zambi, the first baseman, comes to the plate. He grounded out to third her first time up. See if they maybe put specs in motion. The bunt is pushed to first. Rito makes the play. Spex is advanced to second. Now there is two outs. Bree Roberts, the designated player. We'll see if she can't find a hole here. Give the Tigers the lead. Hard strike on the inside corner. Zero one. Not too far outside. Three fouls. That one back into the screen. She's down on the count. One ball and two strikes. One two pitch. Fouled out of play. Go true. Toes the rubber. Here comes the one two. This is high. Two balls, two strikes. Two outs here in the fourth. It's two to two, and there's a runner on second. A lot of twos. There's that two two pitch. This ball hit high into left field. The left fielder's camped out underneath it. She's going to make the catch, and that's going to end the threat for the Tigers. No runs, no hits, 
No hair, no errors. They leave one on base. Move to the fifth, all tied up at two. We'll be right back here on the Neville Network. Mama DeLuca's pizzas are custom made, fresh to order right in front of you. We offer three different sizes of pizza, 9, 12, or 14 inch. Mama DeLuca's pizza is prepared to your order. The pizza cooks in less than three minutes. We have 16 different toppings to choose from, eight unique sauces to complete your pizza. In addition to pizzas, we offer to our customers boneless wings with your choice of a dipping sauce. Mama DeLuca's pizza offers delicious garlic parmesan breadstick, freshly made to order pasta bowls. We're Mama DeLuca's pizza in the subway on Lammy Lane, and we hope to see you soon. Hey Neville Tiger Nation, this season if you find yourself feeling a little under the weather, visit Go Family Health on North 18th Street. They cover flu shots, sports physicals, sick visits, annual visits, or if nothing is wrong, they can do your regular checkup. Go Family Health has a happy staff, clean office, and they can take care of all your family's health care needs. This is Tiffany Tara with Go Family Health. We love our Neville Tigers. And we want to thank all of Neville Nation for always supporting Go Family Health. All right. Gabby Angel, the second baseman for Bo Shin. Set to lead things off here for the Gators. He had a sacrifice and a ground out. Officially 0 for 1. Called strike. Ball lifted high. Behind short, Lofton going over. She's going to make the catch. There's one gone. Lindsay Manuel. She is singled and flown out to second. Did have an RBI back in the first. First pitch is a little bit high. Ball ripped right at L. She did drop it, but she recovers and makes the play as, Ange as Manuel. Thought she was out on the line drive, but uh, a nice play by L. Carter on a rocket from Lindsey Manuel. Or Kristen Lalonde. Hits this one high in the left. KK going back. And it's out of here. The yard would not hold that one. And the law is going to give Del uh, Shin the lead on the two out home run. So Jyla Rito is going to come to the plate. An extra base hit was brought to you by Williams Orthodontics. As we get later in this contest, in the fifth, every run is important. Nice change up there to Rideau. Low. 
Off the end of the bat towards Lofton. Throw overs in time, and that's going to do it. But a big fly gives the Gators the lead right here. A home run by LeLong. One run on that one hit. There were no errors, and nobody left on base. Move to the bottom of the fifth. Boshin back on top. Three to two. We'll be right back. Do you suffer from frequent back or neck pain? Were you in an accident and can't get rid of those constant aches? Maybe you're someone who deals with chronic migraines and tension headaches. It might be time to see how Martinez Chiropractic can help you. The goal of Martinez Chiropractic is to reduce or eliminate pain in just a few sessions using the latest in chiropractic technology. Don't suffer in pain another day. Call Martinez Chiropractic today at 318 654 4310 or see them in person 1828 Tower Drive in Monroe. Eason Portable Buildings is now Eason Manufacturing. New name, same quality service with almost 60 years experience serving the Arklamas. And with Eason Manufacturing, quality is second to none. Buy pre-made from one of our mini lots or custom order yours today. Choose your colors, choose your size. You design it, we build it. Eason Manufacturing, serving the Arklamas since 1961. We're back. The Tigers. Trailing after the home run by Lalonde. Trying to get it back and there's a shot to left center. It's gonna get past the center fielder. Specs hustling around first and she's gonna be into second with the stand up double. And that's one way to do it. That extra base hit brought to you by Williams Orthodontics. It's the hardest ball Boogie's hit since she's returned to the lineup. And now Madeline Jones. Pitch swung on, fouled off the foot of Jones. So one one. Grounded towards the pitcher. Specs is going to advance to third. <coughs> the throw goes to first, and Jones is out. One to three. Now, L. Carter. In the top of the lineup here with one out. Mills, one for two. This ball grounded towards first. They say foul ball off of her foot. As the ball was grounded towards first and Interesting play. Everybody kind of froze. <laughs> so it's a strike on Carter. A one pitch. 
Called strike. Right outside corner. Now two strikes. Tigers have the tie and run 90 feet, or 60 feet away rather. That ball's fouled back to the catcher. It's calling baseball the other day, so forgive me on that one. O2 pitch, grounded back towards the pitcher. Specs is going to try for the plate. Slides in safely, head first. Carter does her job. Gets the RBI ground out. And we've got a tie ball game again. Now Leela Hansen. Reached on an air and flown out to right. Been a back and forth game here. Fitting of the quarterfinal round as that pitch misses inside. It's the fans getting into it. Carl Smith, ball two. Great crowd on hand as they're wrapped around all sides of this ballpark here in Forsyth Park. There's a strike. Like Hanson was taken. Go true. Rocks and fires a 2 1 pitch. This ball lifted deep to right. Is it going to be fair? No. Almost extra bases. Falls harmlessly in foul territory. I'll make it a 2 2 count. And the Tiger senior center fielder. Grounded towards Bonvalet. Throw overs in time. And that's going to retire the side. Tigers tie it up with one run, one hit, no errors. They don't leave anybody on base. We move to the sixth, all tied up at three. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Being a strong team means accomplishing great things by working together. Being a Neville Tiger means striving for excellence in all things. Origin Bank and Neville High School share a long history of making a difference in our community. Together with the Food Bank of Northeast Louisiana, we're able to provide meals to children, families, and seniors facing hunger in Northeast Louisiana. Origin Bank and Neville Tiger football, always a winning combination. Origin Bank, member FDIC. Clean King is a full-service cleaning and restoration company specializing in carpeted upholstery, air ducts and dryer vents, tile and grout, and mold and water extraction. We offer 24-7 emergency water and fire damage service because your emergency is important. We take pride in being locally owned, serving Senla for over 30 years. Trust Clean King to exceed expectations for a healthy home and business. Call us today for a free quote. What a ball game we've got going here 
as we return to the Family Solutions broadcast booth. All tied up at three. Amy Marks takes a ball. Emmy's one for two on the afternoon. There's a strike. Mark singled her last time up. A two and one. Two one pitch. That's low. Three one pitch is high, and if Nicholson has struggled with anything, it's been in the bottom half of this lineup where that's the fourth wall she's issued. in the six to nine hole. Now Jordan Wheeler is gonna stand back in. She's re-entering after the pinch runner. She's walked twice, two of those four times. Those four walks were hers. Nobody out. That pitch is low. Nicholson's got to find the zone here. Another one low as Bagwell tries to come up with it. Has to go through the batter. But Marks going to move up to second. Ball hit hard, deep to left, and it's out of here. A two-run shot from Jordan Wheeler. Another Williams Orthodontics extra base hit. Both Shen regains the lead here, five to three. Still nobody out here in the sixth. Pitch Trey Dozier is out to settle down his pitcher. Shin starting to hit the long ball here. They've got home runs in consecutive innings. Now, Addy Arno, the catcher, who is one for one. She singled and then walked in a run. Her last at bat. Tigers just need to calm themselves down and get it out. Still got a couple of at-bats. That one misses high. one no pitch. Called strike on the inside corner. Nice pitch underneath the hands of Arno by Addy Nicholson. Here's a 1-1. One, one. 
Grounded towards Carter. Ailes got it. Tosses it over to Sarah Zambi. And there's one gone. Now the nine hole, Camille Champagne. Champagne. Doesn't look like Camille's going to hit. Is they're calling for number 11. It's Ava Mallet. Going to pinch hit here. So Ava steps in with one out. Boshan has taken a two-run lead. There's a strike. Off the bat of Jordan Wheeler. The two-run home run. They lead Neville five to three. Swing and a miss. Called strike three on the inside corner. And there's two gone. And back to the top of the order with Bonvale, the shortstop. Just the second strikeout of the ball game. The pitch misses a little wide. Here's a 1-0 pitch. Lifted high into left center. It's gone. No doubter. <laughs> and the bats have woken up here for the Boshan Gators. It makes it six to three. Gators. Gators starting to center up a few. Off of Nicholson. Still two outs for Gabby Angel. Tigers need to get the third. Third out here. Come in and try to cut into this lead. That's going to hit her. I run her on first with two outs. Tigers trying to get out of this inning. Already allowed three runs so far. Hoping to keep it there. This is Lindsey Manuel who lines this one into left center field. Angel making the turn. Throw's going to come in to the middle. Manuel doubles. Shin, runners at second and third with two outs. For Lalong, Kirsten hit the first home run. 
of the afternoon for Beauchamp. Solo shot in the fifth. They're going to put her on. It's going to load the bases. But that's the right move. going to either all talk to one another or what here as Coach Dickey huddles his troops here. It's Jyla Rito. 0 for 3 today. Tigers need an out here. Rito lifts this one. It's going to be behind third base. Ellie Lofton's there to make the catch, and that's going to do it for the Gators. But two big hits. Played three runs. Actually had three total hits. And they leave the bases loaded. There were no errors in that inning. We move to the bottom half of the sixth. Bo Shen back on top, six to three. We'll be right back. I'm Dr. Scott Shelby with Family Solutions. When you hear the words Family Solutions, you may not know that we're a comprehensive, strength-based counseling and psychiatric clinic. Family Solutions provides psychiatric care, individual and couples therapy, child and adolescent counseling, psychological testing, medication management. We also provide occupational therapy, physical therapy, speech therapy, and ABA therapy in one convenient location. For more information on how we can help your family today, visit FamilySolutionsCounseling.org. Mama DeLuca's pizzas are custom made, fresh to order right in front of you. We offer three different sizes of pizza, 9, 12, or 14 inch. Mama DeLuca's pizza is prepared to your order. The pizza cooks in less than three minutes. We have 16 different toppings to choose from, eight unique sauces to complete your pizza. In addition to pizzas, we offer to our customers boneless wings with your choice of a dipping sauce. Mama DeLuca's pizza offers delicious garlic parmesan breadstick, freshly made to order pasta bowls. We're Mama DeLuca's pizza in the subway on Lammy Lane, and we hope to see you soon. Couple of more chances for the Tigers. It starts here in the bottom of the sixth with Ellie Lofton. Have Lofton, Worsham, and Bagwell do up for the Tigers. Lofton laces this one foul. Tigers can't get it all back in one swing. Kind of chop away at this Gator lead. Ball hit to center field. The center fielder's got a beat on it. She's going to make the catch. Lofton's retired on the fly out to center. One gone for KK Worsham. Worsham takes a ball. 
KK's grounded out. Was hit by a pitcher last time up. One-0 pitch. It's high for ball two. Two-row pitch from Lexi, called strike. Gotro, after giving up a couple of runs in the first, has really settled in for Beauchamp. That ball's high. Line into the glove. Nice play by the third baseman, Lalonde. Now Addy Bagwell comes to the plate. Tigers trying to scratch their way back in this one. Boshin playing some good defense here. Pitch just a little bit high. Ball two. Both of these teams trying to punch their ticket to Sulphur. Two O pitch. All strike. Hey, Tiger fans didn't like that one. Ball three. Now three balls and one strike to the Tiger catcher. All four. The Tigers have a base runner. Shanice Specs probably about to come run for Addy. And she will. That's the first walk issued to the Tigers. Worsham was hit by a pitch, but the first walk on the night for Lexi Gotro. Coach Thad Dickey out to talk to his troops. Thad Dickey, brother of Thurman Dickey, here at Thurman's here in Monroe. So I have a little local connection there. Looks like he's done. He's been carrying around that notebook everywhere he goes. Now Sarah Zambi. He's grounded out. Had a sacrifice her last time up. Takes that pitch. Right down the middle for strike one.
If Zambi can get on here, you got Bree Roberts on deck, who definitely has the pop in her bat. Can get the ball out of the ballpark. That one's inside. It's one and one. Specs needs to get back to first because there's no sense in playing around here when you're down three. Two outs. So one and one to count to Sarah. Here's the pitch from Gotra. High, ball two. Here's a 2-1. This looped too short. Bonvalle makes the catch off the hands there of Zambi, and that's going to do it for the Tigers. We move to the seventh. <laughs> Tigers got no runs, no hits. They left one on base right there. They still trail 6-3. to three. We'll be right back here on the Neville Tiger Network. Being a strong team means accomplishing great things by working together. Being a Neville Tiger means striving for excellence in all things. Origin Bank and Neville High School share a long history of making a difference in our community. Together with the Food Bank of Northeast Louisiana, we're able to provide meals to children, families, and seniors facing hunger in Northeast Louisiana. Origin Bank and Neville Tiger football, always a winning combination. Origin Bank, member FDIC. Hey Neville Tiger Nation, this season if you find yourself feeling a little under the weather, visit Go Family Health on North 18th Street. They cover flu shots, sports physicals, sick visits, annual visits, or if nothing is wrong, they can do your regular checkup. Go Family Health has a happy staff, clean office, and they can take care of all your family's health care needs. This is Tiffany Tara with Go Family Health. We love our Neville Tigers. And we want to thank all of Neville Nation for always supporting Go Family Health. We're back. We've reached the top of the seventh. Tigers needing a quick couple of outs here. Try to keep this Gator lead to just three. Emmy Marks leads things off. She's going to take a strike from Nicholson. Marks has singled, flown out, and walked. Officially one for two. One one called strike. One ball and two strikes. Now on the center fielder for Boshin. One two pitch. Tap foul. They got somebody hanging over. The fence out in center. I had it fallen. Everything's put back together. One ball, two strikes. Here's the Nicholson pitch. It's wide. It's two and two. Two-two pitch, grounded towards Lofton. She's up with it. The throw over, 
scooped up nicely by Sarah Zambi, and there's one gone. Well, that's the first out. Jordan Wheeler, who hit the two-run home run last inning, stands in there. There's a strike. Try to stay ahead. The big bat on the designated player here. Lifts this one over the head of Carter. Lofton's going to stab it. But Wheeler's going to have a single. There's a runner on with one out. They're not, I don't know if they're going to run for or not. If they do, Wheeler will be out. They've got to run with a different runner than the last time. And they will. That's number 18. That's running for Jordan. KD Dagapont, I think. <laughs> I apologize for the pronunciation. Now we've got uh, one out, runner on first. That's Addy Arno. Arno. One for two with a walk. Arno squaring, showing bunt. We'll see if she keeps it down. She's going to pull it back. Swing and a miss. Now she tries to bunt that one. This is it completely. Now, oh, and two, the count on Arno. O2 pitch, tapped foul. The 0-2 pitch again. Lifted in the short right. Specs is over there, and she makes the catch. There's two gone. Now Champon. The was pinch hit for last inning, and the pinch hitter struck out. But Champagne is 0 for 2. She comes up here with two outs and a runner on. The top half of the seventh. Tigers needing an out here. That one was a little high. The 1-0, that's high, ball two. This is what Nicholson can't do. You don't want to get back to the top of the lineup here. Got to challenge the nine hole. Here's the 2-0. That's low, ball three. Here's a 3-0 pitch. Ball four, and back to the top of the lineup we go. The fifth walk 
the six to nine hole hitters. Now Bonvalet, who homered her last time up. Officially, she's two for four. This one grounded towards Jones. She's up with it. Throw over, so no harm done with the two-out walk. And the Tigers are down to their final three outs. They trail by three. We'll be right back to get the finale right here on the Neville Tiger Network. Stay with us. You told me one click. You told me one call. You told me you'll get it done. I called. But never got you. Instead, I was handed off to someone else. In fact, I never even met you. Are you even for real? Don't be misled. If you've been injured, you deserve to meet with the actual attorney you saw on TV. At Parker Alexander, you'll meet with me. Or me. We'll fight to get the money you deserve. Remember, there's never a fee unless we get money for you. And that's for real. Clean King is a full-service cleaning and restoration company specializing in carpeted upholstery, air ducts and dryer vents, tile and grout, and mold and water extraction. We offer 24-7 emergency water and fire damage service because your emergency is important. We take pride in being locally owned, serving Senla for over 30 years. Trust Clean King to exceed expectations for a healthy home and business. Call us today for a free quote. Hear the final countdown playing over the speakers here at the Paul McElroy Complex. It all comes down to this. The Tigers trail by three. We're in the bottom of the seventh inning here. Chance to go to Sulphur. The date in the semifinals on the line. Bree Roberts going to lead things off for the Tigers here. Bree's due. He's flown out to left twice. Offers it that one. It stays up a little bit. That's going to be ball one. Roberts fouls this one back and out of play. Here it bang off the roof here in the Family Solutions broadcast booth. Here's the one-one pitch. Hit hard into left and caught. A great catch there, and I, I missed it on the camera, but Manuel was there, made a couple of good catches, and made another one there on a hard hit ball by Bree Roberts. A Boogie Specs doubled her last time up. in there for a ball. Oh, 1-0 to Boogie. Ball two. Tigers need base runners here. Got to be patient at the plate. Two-o pitch, 
popped up high down the third baseline. A lot of people going over the shortstop. Bonvalet is going to make the catch, and the Tigers are down to their final out. Nice play by the Gator shortstop. Had to go a long way to make that catch. And now Nadia Williams is going to pinch hit for Madeline Jones. Got to find a way to reach base. Keep the Tigers alive here. As we're down to their final out. Nadia grounds this one towards Bonvalet. She's up with it to throw over in time, and that's going to do it. The Tigers' run ends here in the quarterfinals as Bo Shin wins this one 6-3. to three. three big home runs in the fifth and sixth inning. The deciding factor here. And the Tigers are going to come up a little bit short. So a heartbreaking one here from Carl Smith for Neville as you know, the eight seniors here at Neville will end their high school career. Right here on their home field. So a tough loss for the Tigers. And uh, we appreciate everybody that has tuned in here and everybody that came out to watch this one. Had a great crowd, a great atmosphere. And we appreciate everybody who's tuned in with us all season long here on the Neville Tiger Network. We look forward to bringing you more events uh, in the upcoming weeks as baseball starts playoffs next week. And we do have tennis championships at the end of next week as well. So stay tuned to our social media pages to keep up to date with the latest things happening here at Neville High School. Once again, your final, Bo Shin 6, Neville 3. That's going to do it for us here from Carl Smith Field. It was a great season. Congratulations to these Lady Tigers.